Lamar Jackson is practicing for the Baltimore Ravens at training camp without a new deal. Watch this entire video, and I'm going to tell you why. Welcome back to the channel, guys. It's your boy, CJ Sports. And today we'll be talking about Lamar Jackson, who the last couple of months have has been almost demanding to get a deal done before training camp. Everyone thought that he was going to do a hold-in situation, kind of what Deontay Johnson, Derwin James, and a few other players are doing. But he decides to show up to practice, and not only that, he actually is practicing, and he's being a full participant. So it's it's a little bit confusing um, why he would do this for someone that was demanding a deal, demanding to get a deal done before training camp. So I'm going to tell you guys kind of why uh, my personal opinion, because we have not been talked about it, but there's also some news kind of about what his teammates think and everything else. So, like I just said, Lamar Jackson was on the field on Wednesday, and the teammates said that there was no indication that his contract was on his mind. So, Jackson will be heading into his fifth year and final season on his rookie deal. So, they picked up the fifth year option of Lamar Jackson. His base salary will be $23 million fully guaranteed this year, but he has no guarantees beyond this year. And every time he steps into the field, the risk of injury can reduce his future earnings so like and that and that's the biggest thing to me like you see like derwin james who will only be making like nine mil you see dk medcalf will be making less than four mil you'll be you see deontay johnson i believe he's in the same uh boat as uh dk medcalf making a little less than four mil you see roquan smith being put on the pup list and he's not even showing up so the team will not find him 100k per uh, day until he shows up until this deal is done but usually like the agents will work on the deal while the player will either participate on the side Lamar Jackson represents himself so we're trying to figure out um, and like some of the times like the actual agents will advise like a player like Lamar Jackson not to practice until the team guarantees that they will pay him the significant money for years to come but like i just said lamar does not have an agent he represents itself and it's unclear to seek and it's unclear to see if he will get a new uh new contract if he still plays out his rookie deal in 2022 he'll be slated to become an unrestricted free agent in march but the ravens would presumably keep him in baltimore by using the franchise tag so he will not be an unrestricted he'll be a restricted free agent so the Baltimore Ravens could use a franchise tag on him. So, the only reason why I think Lamar Jackson is playing football right now is because he truly just wants to play. I think there is uh, something in his mind that's saying, you know, if I just do what I'm supposed to do, and guess what, if we don't get a deal done, I will make $23 million fully guaranteed this year. I get franchise tag next year. I think someone did it on the Pat McAfee show, but this was before uh, Kyler Murray's deal. It was like thirty-seven million, I think, maybe a little bit less than that. With Kyler Murray's deal, probably got bumped up a little bit, so he could be making over the next three years with this twenty-three million dollar deal, and he gets franchise back-to-back -back years. He'll be making almost a hundred million dollars, fully guaranteed. And then he can double dip technically and then go get a monster deal if he's worth that. But, of course, the end, the end thing for Lamar Jackson is injury and then not knowing longevity, you know, where he'll be for the longevity of his career. So, and then Lamar Jackson had to kind of, uh, you know, tiptoe about his thoughts about his contract, but... You know, he shows up on the practice field, indicates that he's willing to play the season without a new deal, which to me is still the weirdest part about this whole thing is that he was demanding a deal before training camp. Now he shows up to training camp, not holding in or holding out. He's just on the field practicing and being a full participant, which is good news for the Ravens so they don't have to deal with Lamar Jackson's situation and his contract. And technically they still have a, a rookie deal quarterback still on their 
uh, payroll, which they're able to pay other players in different positions right now, which ultimately helps the Ravens long term. So let me know if you think the Ravens are going to pay Lamar Jackson by the end of training camp and before week one, or do we think he's going to play out his $23 million fully guaranteed fifth-year option contract? Let me know down in the comments. Guys, we're almost at 100 subscribers, so if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button and like this video. It really helps me out. And it's your boy, CJR Sports, and I'm out. Peace, guys.